Okay, so, uh, I got one thing left to do today in terms of the new base assault update. And that is actually get to some of these base assaults, man. So, these Phoenix bases are procedurally generated across your map. And what I think is the deal is that we're going to ha maybe have to explore some of these locations to see if there's actually a Phoenix base there for us to take on. Uh, and then, okay, little damn control point, sick. Uh, yeah, no Phoenix base, kind of, kind of what I figured would be going on here a little bit. So we're gonna have to explore around a little bit and see if we can get one of these Phoenix bases to actually spawn in. Okay, next up, uh, let's try reducing our region score a little bit and see if that can get one of these boyos to pop in. Oh, friend. Oh. Okay, there we go. Phoenix has taken over a control point. The little damn location. Awesome. So I do think that it was related to the region score. So if you have a maxed out region, uh, try to kill off one of your rivals and that way you'll be able to start generating region score again uh, so that that way Phoenix can then take over those control points. Lil Dam was actually one of the locations that I did want to claim for a base. One of the big benefits of having gone off and scoped out the previous locations like I advised you dudes to do before the update rolled out is that I know which one uh, I like the most in terms of where I would like to build a base at. Uh, and that's pretty handy actually here. So let's scope this boyo out and see what we're dealing with. Got some combat going off in the distance over there, but shouldn't be too much of a problem. It's actually, it's a pretty tiny base, which is to be expected. I think the game doesn't recognize the fact that I had a region maxed out, uh, had the forest region maxed out. So it might actually be a good call to just cull off all of your rivals in the forest region, so that that way you can really start generating a lot of region score. Awesome really start generating some region score and start taking on even bigger versions of these phoenix bases because they'll likely offer maybe more lootables oh oh turbo yeah um i know what to do Boom. Also, there goes one of these little guys. All right, there we go. Okay, some Seekers. In a box? Seekers in a box! What is this thing? Oh, turrets. There's like a purple thing there. Is he gonna start, like, attacking? And I guess this thing is, like, building and summoning in new Phoenix machines. Cool. So, I double-checked with the one and only Burger Man Dude Man, and it is, uh, actually the same system, or at least a very similar system, to the way our own rivals level up with bases. So, what you want to do is, again, you do want to maybe reduce enough score to get a base to spawn in, but then from that point, you can grind and get this base to level up, and then yield better rewards. There we go. That is that. And I got the goggles, yes! I've been looking for days! Oh hey, inside of uh, the one building with all of the seekers inside of it, there was another one of those buildy kind of things. I'm really curious what those actually are. You can open it? Dude! Die! Yes! Okay, let's open this guy up too. Hopefully we get the uh, lightning to go off here. Okay, so there's all the red sparks and stuff. Oh! 
Oh, uh, okay. All right. Oh, big alarm. Yeah, you're in trouble now, boy. Oh, the airstrikes come from him. No. Maybe someday we'll be able to get our own. But I guess now it's just a matter of like demolishing this thing. Oh, and it summons in machines too when you attack it and stuff. Sick. But they just fell into the water and died. <laughs> you did good. You did good, machines. All right, well, let's just continue going about destroying the Phoenix base before we take down the command center. You know, it feels really good to be able to live up to the avalanche motto of blow shit up here in Generation Zero in, like, a brand new way. It feels pretty good, man. So I guess another pro tip. Don't get too close to the Phoenix command center when you're taking it down. Okay. Into the water you go. Oh, hey, I guess the problem with us having demolished most of the base is we don't have much of a base to use for cover when these machines come in. <laughs> okay. There's a nice little uh, red laser tell as well on the ground. Avoiding those should be pretty easy for you to use. Boom! There we go! Oh, what the heck is that? Is that concrete? No way! Explosive, copper, lead, cement! Dude! We've moved into the Stone Age! The 90s was totally the Stone Age. Don't even... Don't. Alright, so... Now we can take over the control point, too! Ah, uh, alright, cool, sick, let's go. Whoa! Poof! <laughs> Poof, truck! Okay, so understandably, you can't build out here except for this one little spot. Oh man, yes, you can totally use the pond in the little damn base. Oh, dude. Definitely, come tomorrow, I'm gonna have these bases ranked. So, there you go, dudes. How to get these bases to spawn as well as my first time taking on a Phoenix base. Uh, you know, in the end, I, I was pretty, pretty spot on about my tips for how to get ready for this update. You're going to want a ton of explosives so that you can lay waste to all of these Phoenix bases. Uh, but again, reduce your region score so that that way you could build up more region score towards these Phoenix bases uh, and get started on that grind. Uh, but for now, my dudes, thank you very much for watching uh, and I will catch you all in the next one. Until then, peace.